you, re yeah. do you reckon there could be any truth to the fact that they are actually cleaning house a little bit? Like, you know, there was the cancellation of the sequels to um, all the Marvel stuff. Are they actually well, realizing their mistake and then bringing in people that actually? That's kind of what I was job? implying because Andre did a really good right, a really good video on this the other day, and he looked at it from all angles. And you have the two videos of Bob Iger where right after January six, where he's like, "We need to get the company involved in stuff," and blah 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 blah. And then you have the video from the same, I believe it's the same day that uh, that uh, um, Elon Musk told him to go himself. <laughs> but he was right there on the stage saying, yeah, we're going to, we're going to deviate away from this kind of stuff. And I, you know, I, I think that the people, the creatives need to understand that, you know, not if the, the story comes first and then the morals and the teaching, blah, 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 you know, all that kind of stuff. It's yeah. a great video. Check it out. I, I'm paraphrasing, but yeah. So I wonder if there isn't a bit of a shift in gears over at the studio. Now, do I think they're going to go unwoke? Oh, hell no. No, oh, yeah, that's hell the thing. no. Is it but going I mean, to actually at, fix the problems? I don't. Think I mean, so. look at Captain Marvel. They clearly edited all the woke shit out of there, right? Like, yeah, the movie's crap, but I don't think we would have even seen that one uh, deleted scene with the lesbian shit had you know T uh, Tessa Thompson not said anything about it, and and some of the other stuff yeah, we wouldn't right. know about either, right? So it, it, we'll have to wait and see how these things go. I mean. Did you it see makes that sense if they want to get rid of pelts? That's the only thing. Did you see that announcement? That uh, well, it's not an announcement; it's a leak that Captain Marvel three, uh, Eternals two, is gone. all these dog shit movies that no one gives a fuck about. But see, that's are, what I'm uh, talking about. Chopped. Yeah, they've, yeah, they've been they've been thrown out, and maybe they are making an actual shift. I mean, I'm just throwing it out there. I'm not saying that they are, but maybe. I, I don't. I doubt it, man. They're too. With these guys. They're too f***ing big to pivot, man. Um, I think we got a few more years of uh, dog water before we get on the other side of this because there's so much stuff that's ar arguably, not arguably, it's already been produced that they're yep. going to put out that's been worked on for the last years, and yeah, it's yeah. going to have all the goofy shit. Yeah, that's I, true. I, I don't you think, think that, that they'll... they'll uh, do you think that they'll like pull some of it back though? Because a lot of the stuff that is coming out, they've been doing extensive reshoots on, and they're losing shitloads of money true. already. Like, that's wouldn't true. it become more uh, of a tax write-off the if they just throw it in the bin? But that's the yeah, thing, yeah, though. Like, yeah, they, that's a good point about yeah, they're doing a lot of reshoots, but are they doing reshoots because it's just trash, or are they doing reshoots because they're trying to edit out the gay shit? I don't know. I don't really have well, an answer to that. I lean towards they ain't they ain't taking that shit out. Well, and you gotta like understand, a... especially right now, like especially right now, if they are, right, let's assume, perfect world. Yeah, they are pivoting. We're entering into election year, man. Like, or we're in the election year. If Trump wins, if Trump wins, it's gonna all bets are off. Then, yeah, I hope you're he does. Right, Eric. I agree with you there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're right, bro. I, I never did think about that because they went hard. Yeah, the woke uh, man, you imagine what oh, happens if he time. gets in again. They, That's what I'm saying. If he wins again, they're, they're cranking it right back up because they yeah. feel like they have to use all of this, these properties as their vehicle. Yeah. Um, to to like be part of the, yeah. I guess, the, see the change in the world and stuff. So if he wins that shit, we're gonna be. I think we're right back to square one. Hey, I think they're gonna Rip, double you, down. Rip, Rip, you right? Because I think the MCU went bad when Trump got it. No, I agree. No, one thousand. No, that's a factual thing that happened. Like he yeah. won, and it made everybody fucking crazy. Like yeah. we were seeing things we had never seen. They made Trump Modoc, bro. Like we were seeing <laughs> things happening in comics that made no. They were yeah. never doing that weird stuff. It was yeah. Trump made them crazy, man. And yeah. and 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 more ways. And they made Modoc into Trump. <laughs> yeah, they made. That's all I'm saying. They made. He was literally. He was literally Trump. For people that don't know, uh, DC did it when they made Joker. I forget who wrote that. Was it Frank Miller? Somebody wrote that. And, a, and Joker was literally Trump, right? In, in that, like they were, they went crazy. These guys cannot keep themselves contained. Pedro Pascal's they, character in uh, Wonder Woman eighty four was based on Trump too. Yeah, they, they can't uh, leave yeah, it at the door. They did. They, they did something with Joker do. where they were like, "I would not work with Nazis or something." Like, oh yeah, I'm yeah, still an American. And then you know, flashback <laughs> to after he killed Jason Todd and he was a fucking ambassador for Saudi Arabia or whatever the. <laughs> it was dude i still love that comic <laughs>
Yeah, man, that's uh. Yeah, I got it pulled here. This is what they did to fucking Modoc. Yeah, this isn't a real Mo Marvel Doc comic. Trump. Yeah, he's literally Trump. Yeah. No. <laughs> Nah, I, <laughs> I wasn't making that up. <laughs> he was literally Trump. Oh my God, is that actually real? Yeah, yeah, that's oh real. Yeah. <laughs> that's the best thing I've ever seen. Yeah, that's crazy. That's so funny. Trump made these people fucking nuts. So even if whatever progress that they make, I think wow. as we start get at like the people that are creating right now, there's going to be projects that are going to get green lit at various stages um, going into November. So I think those projects are all going to be shit. They're going to be heavy handed because people are going to be hyped up on the election in general. If yeah. that man wins, these people are going nuts again. We're, it, it's going to be like deja vu. We're all going to be on stream feeling like the shit was eight years ago. Like, because it's going to all be deja vu. They, they're not going to stop talking about it. Your favorite actors and actresses are going to be tweeting nonstop. Uh, talking about what they must do and how they must use their art and, and their they're entertainment. They're going to leave the country. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah. They always threaten to do that. 